Emily. Welcome back to box five of my aunt's collection, a new channel just showing off my aunt's Fenton collection. I might go into her other collections later on, but right now I'm focusing on the Fenton. Um, I unfortunately don't have her entire collection as I've been selling it, which is such a bummer. I wish I had started out doing this, making these great videos. Um, before I started selling it off so it was complete. I have sold all of her Fenton shoes, all of her Burmese Fenton, and a bunch of other stuff, but there's plenty more and there's probably 60 more boxes behind me. This is box number five. So thank you for watching and please subscribe, like, thumbs up, all the things, and comment. Let me know if there's anything that I can do to change things. Um, I'm in the shade today. It's so bright out. I normally am over there <laughs> In my other spot but right now I'm here because it's so bright and I hope you can see what I'm gonna do um, it looks like baskets if I were to look at it but we're just gonna dive in because I the reason I say that is because there's a basket right on top <laughs> oh my gosh look at this thing oh my gosh it's a little sticker let's see hand painted by is that a DD Wyman. Is that right? Number 353 out of 1950. The Honor Collection. So this is not for me to sell it. I'm just showing it. Um, I am posting it kind of at my leisure on OfferUp. Um, I believe the link is below. No pressure. I'm kind of just here to show because I, this is kind of my way of keeping my aunt's collection together. Because um, it's been kind of a bummer to sell it off piece by piece like this. But it's still really, really fun. And everyone gets to enjoy it this way. And I know part of the fun of collecting, especially for those really, you know, diehard collectors, they really want to see what's inside these boxes. And there are some pieces that are just incredible. So, anyways. Piece number one. Here, can you see that good? Okay. Oh. This one. I already can tell it's gonna swim out of the paper. What is it? A dolphin. Oh my gosh. This thing is so heavy and it's got a big letter D on the bottom. If you wanted to comment and tell me what the D is, that would be fine. <laughs> I'm learning a lot about Fenton because I did not collect Fenton before she came to me and asked me to help her liquidate. So, here we are. Praying children, clear. Cute little. Good. Good. A hat. I know that there's a box of just hats. So, if you like hats, stay tuned. Cute little hat. Oh, oh my gosh. That's so amazing. D. Frederick inside. D. Frederick. Some more praying children. There's quite a few praying children. I know that these are pretty special. Little eyes. Oh, what is it? <laughs> ah, he's so cute. Kind of reminds me of Alice in Wonderland. No, I'm kidding. Don't freak out. I'm not gonna drop it. <laughs> You guys are at home and saying, don't do that. You're gonna drop it, break it. <laughs> oh my gosh. That would be a really funny, well, not funny, a sad video if I ever drop something while recording for you guys. Oh my, god. oh my god. That's cool. I like the little gold spots. Whenever they put gems or anything, because I'm kind of a sparkly kind of a person. So if there was any gems on there, there was actually some shoes she had that were the big ones, they were huge. I couldn't, so regular shoes, you know, but these ones were double. 
and they had gems on them. They were so cute. Or like a 3D rose. I really wish I had those to show you. Sorry about that. But this is pretty cool too. A, sh a boot. A boot. A boot, a boot, a boot. Okay. <clears throat> White. Praying children. Cute. My dog. She just snored. She's right over there sleeping. <laughs> oh, she likes to keep me company while I'm doing all my stuff. And when I say keep me company, I mean sleep near me. Oh, look at this. Oh, maybe I should look at the, hang on, hand painted by B. Fox, or sorry, D. Fox. And then it says Dan Fenton, right there. Signature. Cool. I didn't show this one on the bottom. I'll just go back. This one has another Fenton signature on the bottom. And it says, hand painted by B. Williams. Wait, William. That's an E. <laughs> Please comment. Comment on how I can't read the signatures. What is wrong with you? There's too many artists. <laughs> and I can't read their cursive. A box. What's inside the box? It's like Christmas. What's in the box? Should I shake? I shouldn't shake it. Okay. All right. All right. I can hear you all talking to me. Don't shake the box. It's glass, you crazy girl. I know. Okay. All right. This is... Oh, oh, you know what? I thought it was a hummingbird feeder, but it's not. It's an oil lamp. Whoa. Cool. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Like an oil lamp. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. And the wicks. And the top piece. Oh my gosh. <laughs> And a little funnel for the oil. Wow. That's pretty amazing. Wow. That's so cool. There was nothing on the bottom except for a sticker. Still in its box. My goodness. I wonder if someday someone will put oil in it and burn it. Or if it's too much of a collectible. I don't know. That's pretty cool. Wow. Okay. What's next? What's next? Ooh, a boot. A boot. I love all the different... I think they made the little hobnails different colors. Can you see? Green and red and pink and dark blue. Those are so fun. Let's see what it says. Oh, Frank M. Fenton. There's his signature. And then hand-painted by M. Nutter. N-U-T-T-E-R. And the stamp. Goodness. Good. A dog. A dog. Clear, but mighty. Playful puppy, I think that's, that's what that was called. Oh yeah, here's another one. Another little playful puppy. Little butt sticking up. Pretty cute. Oh. Cat. I had quite a few of these. I've sold quite a few of these tall cats. Some of them, most of them were clear. And this one's pretty cute. There's so many critters. I know there are many boxes that are just full of critters. Okay. Anybody? Anybody? It looks like an iceberg or for a polar bear <laughs> and an F on the bottom. I think it's a paperweight. An ice, it, I think it's called the iceberg paperweight. I haven't seen one in purple though. That's pretty cool. It's, can you see the purple? Yeah, you can. Okay. It's purple. He's cute. Uh, actually, well, oh, oh, that's okay. I've only ever seen even photos of it in blue. So that's a new one. An elephant. So cute. I'm partial to elephants. They've been my favorite animal for 
couple decades. Clown. He's got a couple stickers on the bottom. So many stickers. Oh. You know, I had four of these. I had a blue one and a pink one and a red one and a dark blue one. So like a light blue and dark blue. And I thought that this one would be the big popular one because it's hand painted. And I just love when they, they crush up the glass and they put it to make a texture on there. I love that. But it's still, someone still hasn't bought it. It's like, okay. Hand painted by P. Hickman. That's wonderful. One day I will find the person who will love it forever. Oh, oh man, these are warm. They're out in the sun. Praying children, blue. Blue. So cute. Oh, do, 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 do. do you want to see the box like me reaching into the box? I can move the box in front so you can see. Violets in the snow. One, two, three clusters. None on the front and back, just on the sides. Hand painted by Fenton. And then it says Kim Blake. Hand painted by Kim Blake. On the bottom. <clears throat> okay, a little purple owl. He's pretty cute. <clears throat> oh! A clown. What does he say? Um, hand painted by A. Sally. L S A L L E E. Can you see? Yeah. Okay. Well. Oh 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 dear. <laughs> I need to slow down. I don't want to drop anything. Whoa. That's. Pretty cool. Can you hear the rooster off in the distance? <laughs> I live on acreage up near the Canadian border. So there's mountains over there. I should show you. Do a little scan. I just found one of the, I thought that all of the, these sold, but they, they didn't. Well, or maybe this is in a different box. My neighbor's gonna go by, so my dog's gonna bark. Yeah. He's gotta tell us about it. Yeah. Wave. Hey! I'm recording. Actually, it's the post. Oh my goodness. There's a sticker. Pretty cool. Oh, I guess it's perfume, perfume bottle box. That's pretty. It's beautiful. I came up with a lot of pretty cool things. Oh, oh, <laughs> when I first saw these, I had no idea what they were, but they're love bugs. They're pretty cute. A little clear one. A little antennae. Oh, I know who's gonna love that. Brandy, there you go. Here's a little sneak preview. I know you're gonna want it. That's okay, you can have it. Let's see, it says 75 on the bottom. Okay. I'd rather it go to someone that will love it. Make an extra five dollars. <laughs> I'll put that back there so you can see it. Can you still see it? Maybe I'll put it here. There you go. You can still look at it. 
Because <laughs> I know you're watching. <laughs> oh, a cat. I'm sorry, I can't read this one. Hand painted by K L Z O A R D U S. Gosh, that's a really, really difficult one to read. I'm sorry, and I hope that it's not backwards for you. Oh dear, that's okay. Can't read them all. Can't read them all. Ooh. A songbird. I think it looks like about five more in here. Oh, an elephant. You know, I really like this. Maybe I'll keep this guy. He's pretty cute. He's pretty cute. And I like him. By C.A. Howe. I think he's pretty cute. I think I'm going to put him on my, on my shelf. I like elephants. They've been my favorite animal since high school. A little Burmese shoe. I remember this one though because it has a chip. Yeah, it's a bummer. But still, still awesome. Someone will love it. Someone will love that. I don't know who, but someone will. Another clown. <laughs> what does this say? By D Y E U E L. I don't recognize that one. Pretty cute. They're not creepy, you know, some clowns can be a little weird, but those are cute. Fox. Oh man, he's gorgeous. A little sunflower. Hand painted by Anderson. Anderson, you did a good job. Maybe if I put him here. Oh, a bell. A violet's in the snow bell. I haven't met any bell collectors yet. A. Bush. B U S C H. I haven't met any bell. I have to comment if you're a bell collector. I've got about 12 boxes of bells. <laughs> and I will f do videos for them all for you. A violet's in the snow cat. Oh, he's cute. I can't read it. It says hand painted by C.E. But then the stickers kind of cover up the rest. But he's pretty cute. I know I have a box that's just got packed with violets in the snow. Oh, I thought there was one more. One more. Oh yeah, elephant. And purple, of course. Oh, he's so cute. I think I'm going to put him on my shelf too. Is that wrong? I'm supposed to be, <laughs> I'm supposed to be liquidating the collection, not moving it from my aunt's house to my house, <laughs> which I kind of <laughs> did. It's too pretty. Okay. What does it say? Lennox. It says Lennox on the bottom. Okay. Don't tell anyone, but I'm going to keep these. There was another elephant, wasn't there? I thought there was. You know what? He was sitting down and I sold him yesterday. <laughs> That's right. To, I remember now. Oh, well, he was pretty cute. Okay. Box number five. I hope you liked it. <laughs> Have a good day.